Uh, another small update on the Revel 148 PV1 Ventura. Uh, I've done a few things already and right now the kit is like this. Well guys, right now the kit is already like this, it's primed. I have the propellers painted, yes, yeah, since yesterday. I've made the, um, I think it's Bolton Tower. Um, the tower that goes right here. Um, I already have built the tower. Um, I have to uh, just give it a pre-shade, uh, sorry, a bit of a wash here. Um, I've done some small chipping, which you can see here, but uh, very small stuff. Um, it's already primed. As you can see, this piece here is so good that just snap fit it and I can remove all the sponge that I placed to protect it. Um, I also protect, protected here the Bombay. I couldn't use the Bombay doors because they're made two halves. Each door has two pieces. So it wasn't one unique piece. So I just had to use uh, masking tape and sponge, which you can see here, protect it. I'm just removing this first time. I will use it again when painted, of course. So let's place it again. I will then adjust it a bit, just a bit, but now, for now, it can be like this. So, here, uh, I could place it or mask it, but I already primed it, and then I will just paint the, the machine guns a bit. The canopy fitted well, um, fitted well, I just had to uh, place a bit of putty here underneath just to a small gap that it had so right now I protected the engines also with some masking tape with some masking tape here and here um, and um, try to fix this gap here between I managed to fix here and here I just have to give it a little bit of sanding here on this one. I used Tamiya primer and all I can tell you is that it is, it is a very very straightforward build. Um, I just have some few pieces, small pieces. Um, mainly the, the basic kit is right here paint it. I just have to um, paint and, and just place some small pieces uh, and landing gear and such. Um, I will maybe um, try to uh, deepen a bit the panel lines. Uh, they are very smooth but if I can just scrape it a bit I will do that um, I'll have to see if I can do it with very very careful very carefully and basically uh, it's like this it's um, it's a very very pleasant build a very pleasant kit and and uh, well and well, it's um, it's a very good kit. I needed just this just to take some relief uh, of the build of the space shuttle, and it's going well. Um, next, I think I will do a pre-shade, some pre-shade, and some panel lines with some matte black or dark gray, and let's see what I can um, do with this one. Uh, I'm just uh, researching right now the right shade of blue 
and trying to make it a bit old uh, not too old but let's see so guys right now the plane is like that I hope you enjoyed the, this one I will keep you posted and again if you guys know something about this kit uh, please tell me uh, anything about the colors I can follow the Ravel paint guide but um, I'm doing my research I'm, I'm not the best doing research but sometimes it pays off so I want to get that blue uh, shade correctly um, maybe to weather it just a bit I don't know and um, if you guys or some of you guys know something please share it with me okay so I hope you enjoyed this one okay keep modeling always with a smile and um, see you in the next one okay bye bye and God bless <laughs>